hey guys, guess what? I'm on a new server. Um, yep, Serenity shut down, and the Serenity vanilla shut down. Uh, and I can understand why they didn't have enough, didn't have enough players on. Everybody was playing FTB and not making enough money to keep the uh, server running, which I understand. I'm not mad at all. Uh, TJ did what he could for as long as he could, and I really appreciate that. I really liked Serenity, and it'll always be my Minecraft home, but for at least for the time being, it's possible it could come back, but at least for now, my new home is Athcraft. That's A-T-H-C-R-A-F-T. And, yeah. I will put a link to the website and to the even address for the, the server in the description, maybe even at the end of the video. Um, but, yeah. I have to, I'm, actually, if I'm going to record, I have to put that in the video or, or in the description anyway. That's kind of one of the rules here, but that's okay. I would have done that anyway. So, here we are. Uh, you can see I've got my villagers going up there. That's something I'm always going to have. And my food sources. And let's see, horses over there. And in the barn over there, I've got some horses, a couple of donkeys, a mule, that sort of thing. But what I got to do today, at least for now, gonna make this a rather short episode hopefully it's not gonna be very long I haven't been making haven't made a video in a while so yeah so let's see what we can do we're gonna go down here to the basement where I have my farms at and uh, I have a nether wart farm down here that uh, it was just a basic nether wart farm you harvest by hand you know doo -doo -doo, with by punching but one of our players here Magrathea came over and semi-automated the harvesting of this thing. So under here and under here are, well, actually under here, <laughs> are pistons. And they kind of shift this whole thing back and forth when you press this button here. Watch, you'll see. Okay. So that's one, that's one way of doing it. I want it to go a little bit faster though. So what I'm going to do is ugh, I'm going to put a what do you call it thing, basically a quick pulser on there. Um I can't feel the life of me remember what the thing is called now. Anyway, it's just a type of circuit that when you apply a redstone signal to it, it pulses quickly one time. And I'm not going to do my standard one with the torches, the two torches and the uh, repeater and the redstone torches. Yeah, the redstone torches. Yeah. <laughs> okay, give me a break. I haven't, I haven't recorded in a while. Jeez. All right. So what we have here is let me put this stuff in the chest. I don't need that either. Here we go. Let's move that over. All right. We're going to go down in here where this is at. And. We are going to go, how about right here, make a little room. And did I, I don't think I brought any torches down with me, did I? Really? There, that'll work. I better pro should probably get some smooth stone too while I'm at this. Let's just grab a stack of that. Get this cobble over here and let it start burning okay uh now what do i want to do i want to open this up a little bit more for one thing Ooh, oh oh that's where my chicken farm is at uh, we'll just leave whoops um hmm maybe i don't yeah i'm gonna need that too okay well crap we'll just put this here for now we'll see what we can do um Okay, well, I'm going to use this for now. I'm going to put it... Well, <laughs> no. There. Take that. 
Oh, that's a too high gap. I'm going to get monsters in there. Seriously? That won't work at all. Let's just put all the way around here. Wow. Let's just put this here for now. Magrathea. <clears throat> Mag, for short, found some diamonds down here. And I ended up getting a bunch of diamonds out of it. <clears throat> so let's see. If I put a that there and that right there, that should have broken that. At least I would have thought that it would. And it didn't. Okay, well, I can fix that too. I just have to put a solid block there. Take that out. It's okay. I would have had to make another one of these anyway. Let's use cobble. There we go. Now then, here's what we're going to do. I am going to go... <sighs> this is kind of tight. So I'm going to put a redstone torch there. And a hopper here. We're going to break this. Monostable circuit. That's what this is called. I knew I was thinking of <laughs> something. All right, now then. Let's get on here and see. Yep, that turns that off. Perfect. All right, now, if I put this in here, it should disappear and go into this one. Okay. Now, when I click that button right there, what it's going to do is turn off this torch, which is locking this hopper. And that piece of cobble... Or yeah, cobblestone will go over here and immediately right back in there, providing a quick pulse. So, what we're going to do now, let's see here. Because I need to be able to get this in there. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's a comparator. Good. And now I'm going to put this here. Yes. <clears throat> Oops. <laughs> okay. All right, that one's set on three. Let's move it down here. All right, now then, if I put that there, that doesn't need to go in there like that anyway. Okay. All right, good. Now... Oh, I did not prepare myself. Look here. That's okay. I have a redstone right here. Right here. Now, I hope this is going to do what I need it to do. Double pulse. Really? Interesting. It's not like it hurts anything. I wasn't hoping for a double pulse, but... Ooh, that didn't do any good, huh? So what if what did I break down here? <laughs> um hmm. Maybe I didn't think this through right uh enough. Hmm. Okay, so this one is going to go maybe I need just some more delay on this one. Yeah, put a little more delay on it. Oh, I'm stuck. Here we go. Now, let's try this again, see what happens. Okay, that worked, but why am I getting double pulse here? Okay, let's take a look at this and see what happens. Well, I know what's causing it. Uh, okay, so this is staying off long enough for the piece of cobble to go over here and back over here and back. That's what's causing the double pulse. But, honestly, that's not hurting anything. Especially with the extra delay over there. It's pushing things back. So, maybe a little bit less delay there. Will that work? I mean, it's not going to keep it from double pulsing, but... Yeah. Huh. Okay. Oh, 
well, that's going to continue to work anyway. Um, I think I can deal with that. However, I don't know. I don't think monsters can spawn. Uh, mobs can spawn on redstone like this. But, just in case, I'm filling this in. Okay? Okay, so that one I'm not going to do anything with. And I'm going to leave these two open. If I put something here, that's really going to make a mess. Well, I thought it would, but... We'll just put a half slab there so nothing can happen. Now, did I break anything? Nope. Okay. Alright, let's fill this back in. Um, yeah, we'll leave that. And... I need... One of these. Give me a sec here. Help. I don't need six, but that's what you get. And I missed. There we go. We'll put this back on top like this. Does it still work? That's better. Okay, so maybe it's not as nice sounding as it was. But... It does the exact same thing, and it doesn't really do it any faster. Well, boy, I'm telling you what, I'm just making a really good start off to, hey, it's season two. <laughs> I might as well call it season two. I'm on a new server, and I'm basically just starting all over here, so why not? Oh, by the way, this. I'm going to automate this. Uh, I'll semi-automate. It's going to be a push button like that. When 1.8 comes out, if we're still on the same map, I am going to put uh, slime blocks behind here and use one piston instead of using, like, what is that, five, twenty different pistons, because we don't have a creative, we have a creative world here, I'm not allowed to use it, and I won't be until I donate, but we don't have a frontier world here, a resource gathering world, so I'm kind of limited on the resources I've got, so I'm gonna have to, I have to be careful. What, how much iron and stuff I use. I mean, I've got lots of iron, and now that I have... Oh, can you guess what this is for? If you know me, you know what all this sugar cane is for, huh? So, down here... Oh, goodness. Let me turn these guys down. How about that? Sounds, music and sounds. Uh, friendly creatures. Let's turn them down to there. Good. This guy right here, guess what he is. He is... Ah, a perfect paper villager right there. So, he buys all my paper and he gives me emeralds, which I don't think I have any right now because I used them all up. Well, there's 64 emeralds and six more right there. I used them up unlocking this guy and he wasn't very nice to me. Uh, up there, at the top of that, that's how you get my villagers down here, by the way. Oh, this guy sells a Silk Touch book. It's the only reason he's still around. I would have gotten rid of him long ago. But, let's get out of here. I'm going to go back upstairs, and we'll take a quick look around my place. Um, you'll notice back there, there's a ravine back there. You can't see it from here, but trust me, at the end of that hole, and if you go down, there's a small ravine back there. And, uh, oh, there's the owner of our server. Hi, dear. Ouch. Okay. Yeah, whenever a VIP or a mod or the owner of the server logs on, you get that. Also, I have, uh, let's see here, what are we running? We're running MCMMO, and I believe they've got Towny on here as well. You can see the names, uh, Wayward and Crescent and that sort of thing, after people's, or before people's names. Uh, if you go over and look at mine, uh, mine says Joto and, what is that, Skyle, Skeel? That's nation and town that I belong to, which, where I'm at, there is no town. Uh, <laughs> there's nothing anywhere near me. Um, Spawn, I believe, is 
that way. Quite a good ways. It's a long ways, like almost 4,000 meters. So this way, up here, I have a little storage here. Let me see if I have a sword in here, just something to keep the monsters off while I go outside. And this is my just my little house. You've seen pretty much everything I've got. Uh, go outside. Oh, somebody turned the rain off. <clears throat> and we've got MCMMO. Uh, whoa, there he is. Hi. That's Athlevard. Recording. You gonna say something back? <laughs> He's gonna hide. Maybe I should talk. Somebody's a horse. He's gone. <laughs> okay. Hop, hop, hop. You've seen my pigs. You've seen my cows. All these guys. I gotta do something about these villagers. How many villagers are in there? There's 36. I need to... Oops. Murder some of these villagers. There, there's too many. <laughs> there's my farm, anyway. Oh, he's got Grum. I named my horse Grum so he would turn upside down. I kind of did that the last time around, too. Uh, oh, is he typing? Sure looks funny. Have you considered where your butt is? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll go put him back in his his pen over here. Oh, getting a little bit of lag. Um. Oh, here he goes. This is his can. His. Yeah. So. <laughs> was about to wrap up and edit. I need to get back into the habit of keeping my mouth running. <clears throat> I'm supposed to be doing that. Uh, he's typing. I do, but haven't used it in a while. But, yeah. Villagers, some of these guys are going to have to die, and I'm not going to do that on camera. Holy cow! Really? Uh, like 12. <laughs> I do it for fun anyway. Cows, horses, sheep. Where'd he go? Is he around here anywhere? 
Okay. I'm gonna go. Uh, well, if you want to send me your YouTube, you'll have one more follower. <laughs> Let's see. I'm just. 71. Mm -hmm. Or. Stanley. Same channel. Okay, let's get back. Whoop, fall in the hole. Now, let's see if I can get the skill roll in here. Ah, nope. I want to do that one time before I leave. You can great you can get graceful landing or you can get rolled when you hit the ground. I want to do that. Let's see here. Come on. Give it to me. Oh, I, I still I haven't showed you my skelly farm. I guess I'll do that next episode. And jump. Dang it. Come on now. Give me one of my skills. Huh. Well, I, I leveled up anyway. I've only been playing on here a couple of weeks, so my levels aren't really that high, and it looks like it's just not going to do it for me. <laughs> really? <laughs> Let's see. You. Yup. You asked me to. Yep, that was me. Look back through some of my old episodes and you'll find it. Let's see if we can get a, a good quick perspective up here. And I will just log off right up here, I think. Ah. Right here's a good spot. So we have home down there. We have stables. We have farm. We have villagers. Sheep, horses, donkeys, cows, pigs. Uh, project chests, those really have to be moved. I picked this spot though because it's sheltered. The only really real place enemies can get in is like over the tops of these and that way and there's a little bit that way. Uh, I picked this spot because that water runs down there and anything that tries to come through that gap gets uh, washed out and it's pushed back that way so it's really hard for anything to get in here. So I believe that's going to be it though. Um, as the moon rises over the mountains, I'm going to turn around here, and I'm going to say goodbye to everyone. I'll be back, and have a really good one. We'll see you later. Bye. Ow.